Hot Cares Christmas. Spreading joy through Joburg on Hot 1027. Here we are, 2022 Hot Cares Christmas time. Yeah, we're going to spend some of that 8.9 million rand we raised at this year's Telethon, uh, thanks to you. And it's the story of Sally and Jay, mother and daughter. Those are not their real names. We don't want to use their real names. They've been through a rough time of it over the last 18 months. Rough to say the least. I mean, it's an underestimation to say that. Uh, The better part of 2021 and 2022, Sally and her daughter Jane have spent living on the streets and parks um, under bus shelters in and around Benoni Town. And Sally does work at a salon and she managed to save a little bit of money for her and her daughter to get a one bedroom apartment. She had that money stolen. Sleeping on the park, get up in the morning, going to work. And what I've earned couldn't even get us a room or a a place to stay. The other thing um, about Jane is she's now quite ill. She's found herself in a diabetic situation. She's you know, diabetic, and the problem with that type of diabetes is you need insulin, which needs to be refrigerated. Mm. And if you're on and off the streets, it's not like you can keep a fridge around. And in fact, you oftentimes have to pay somebody protection to keep your belongings from being stolen while you're out trying to earn a living. So it's been a really, really difficult time for yeah. Sally and Jane. And what what has carried you through this process so far? What my mom to help her? She's helped us our whole life. What kind of a person is your mum? For our listeners who aren't lucky enough to meet your mum today. And she's the type of person who lost her business because of helping other people. We can cross to Tara Penny, who's in Benoni with the mum and daughter this morning. Good morning, Tara. Hi, Tony. I've got Jane and I've got Sally standing in front of me right now at the moment. Um, I believe you guys would like to have a word with them. Uh, You and your mum have had such a torrid time, haven't you? Yes, we have. Well, we um, have got you on the line because we want to give you a little bit of good news for Christmas. We understand that you've had a tough time with being able to keep the medication uh, refrigerated um, to keep your insulin safe. So we would like to purchase for you a fridge so that you can keep your insulin safe. That's valued at 5,000 Rand. Thank you. We would also like to be able to fill up that fridge with some groceries. So we're adding in a checkers voucher with 1,500 Rand. Thank you. (laughs) And then, um, so that you can make your new space and your new home your own, and so that um, Jane has some lovely clothing for her graduation, we'd like to throw in uh, some vouchers for clothing and for home care from Mr. Price as well. Thank you so much. Uh, you know, you know the, the, the whole point is you need to keep working doing your hairdressing. So um, we want to give you 4,000 Rand for six months. So that's going to help you. Thank you. That can pay my rent to chair. Exactly. That's what we want you to do is to carry on working and not worry about how you're going to do that and so that Jane can continue with her studies and finish off with a bang as she already has and for you to be safe in your home with your medication and your clothing and your groceries. You really have have been through so much. I hope this is going to make your life a little bit easier. What to say I'm so grateful be thankful to you I didn't know there's people out there that really care really I'm so grateful for this 